year, 1.6 billion tyres become waste worldwide. It represents 3.5 million tonnes of waste in Europe. How to exploit this lost material? Offering a great potential for material recovery. A major project was born, Black Cycle, a collaborative European project funded by the Horizon 2020 Research and Innovation Programme, whose consortium is formed by 12 partners from five different countries, Orion, Ineris, Qantas, Ikemsil, Aliapur, CSIC, CPERI, CERTH, Cisna, Pyram, Estato, Hera and Accelera and led by the French world leader in tyre manufacturing, Michelin. Officially launched in May 2020, the Black Cycle project aims to address this issue by creating a massive circular economy of end-of-life tyres in Europe. This project will design world-first processes to make new tyres from end-of-life tyres. Black Cycle partners will demonstrate the technical, environmental and economic viability of these circular processes. The Black Cycle project is based on a unique European public-private partnership that gathers all the necessary competencies along with the circular value chain to ensure its success. The Black Cycle project aims at creating, developing and optimising a full value chain from ELT feedstock to secondary raw materials, SRMs, by offering an economically and environmentally viable alternative. These SRMs will be used to develop new ranges of passenger car and truck tyres, which will be sold commercially in European and global markets. Thanks to Black Cycle, it's expected to valorise 100% ELTs selected, increase up to 10 times SRMs' rates into new tyres, recycle at least 50% of the European ELTs, which represent a 50% decrease of CO2 emission. Which are the ways employed? This value chain needs major stages that involve European industrials and academics. End-of-life tyres are first collected by the French company Eliaper. Our mission is to collect the end-of-life tyre from 40,000 tyre fitters thanks to a network of 25 collectors. Our mission is also the sorting in the premise of this collector to determine which tyre can be reused, so the second-hand tyre. We also have to promote the preparation for recycling, thanks to 14 transformation sites, and we have to contract with 14 or 25 seats abroad and in France. We are a supplier of raw material, as we have the responsibility to select the tyre. And then sorted and crushed into granulates by Hera and Estato. It is bringing to the Black Cycle project more than 10 years of industrial experience in the production of rubber granulates and of micronized rubber power from air flap tires, both from truck and from passenger car. The mission of ERA in Black Cycle is double. To give support to Estato as backup granulator, to ensure the production and the shipment of all the required volume of rubber granulates needed for testing and for production by our pyrolysis partners, and to produce micronized rubber powder MRP, from the rubber portions of the end-of-life tires not appropriate for the pyrolysis, carrying the due testing and characterizations in search of high-value industrial applications for such MRP as secondary raw material. Black Cycle proposes replacing the whole tires reading by a smart reconstruction of the used tire, using automatic devices to separate specific parts as the thread as the inner liner to have an optimum quality feedstock, fully clean of metal and textile, to generate high value secondary raw materials through pyrolysis in the case of thread or powder micronization in the case of the inner liner. The process consists of the anaerobic thermal degradation of polymer material, producing three different products oil, gas, and coke. Here, a defined temperature input is decisive for the stability of the product quality. In the project, we investigate in our moving bed technology the effects of feedstock, tire type and part of the tire, process temperature and residence time onto the composition of the different products. Granulates are pyrolyzed by the ICB, CSIC, Pyram and Cisna to obtain oils, which are refined and optimized by CPERI, CERTH, to be used by Orion to produce sustainable carbon black. 
In Orion, we have many processes to produce carbon black. Um, we choose the furnace process as the most suitable process for carbon black, as this is a process where we can produce high volumes which are needed for rubber black production. For the black cycle project, we used an oil we obtained from our partners, injected it in the furnace process. We work with our partners to obtain a better oil in respect of yield and we work ourselves on the process to adjust the parameters to make this process more adaptable to the quality and the yield for our business. We successfully produce different grades of sustainable carbon blacks that exactly match the properties of those made from conventional fossil-based feedstocks. Those products can be used in different parts of the tire, like the tread or the sidewalls, First, this technology can also be used to produce other sustainable carbon blacks for different applications, including rubber goods, plastics, coatings and printing inks. The final step is the design of the new tyres by Michelin, using the sustainable raw materials coming from the recycling of the ELT. End-of-life tyres is clearly a major stake for a more sustainable mobility. Tires manufacturers have taken actions since a long time to collect and valorize tires in different usage. We are today in a worldwide situation where 90% of end of life tires are collected. Michelin, as a leader of sustainable mobility, decided to go further and take actions to integrate more materials coming from end of life tires. We launched a program of actions, including the definition of a new research project, so called Black Cycle that aims to maximize, through the creation of a new value chain, this ability to use more materials from tires into new tires. By Michelin, we think that the future of mobility is to be all sustainable. This direction is clearly involving all the life cycle of the tires, reducing environmental impact of each step of the cycle. It means that the future of tires will be to deliver a high level of performance to all our customers, less rolling resistant tires, more wear performance, and in parallel, to have more and more sustainable raw materials in our new products. <laughs>